Ladies and gentlemen, what is up? It's your boy Kyle A, and we are here with the WBE World Battle Entertainment. This is actually week one, um, so this is a brand new league. My boy A Drive founded this league, and the P4G is not going anywhere. You know, we still got that going on, so you know that that's a uh, that's all good right there. But we are taking on the numbest. Double N, Num Nexus. His link is down below. Make sure you guys go check him out. Check out everybody in the league, but definitely make sure you're checking out Nexus and his Pittsburgh Pichus, okay? I've got my squad underneath me right here, and, um, uh, fuck, what do we do? Uh, it's just normal battle. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to mess it up. But, uh, yeah, I got my, my, uh, team under me, and then I got what I think he's gonna be bringing under him, um, under the main screen over there. Now, I uh, uploaded a team builder yesterday, so if you guys are interested in, like, the sets and, you know, like, the each attack and, like, the EVs and stuff, you guys can check out that, um, that video. It's on my channel, so... Anyways, I am super hype about this league, man. It, it's gonna be so much fun. This is a, uh... Let the battle... Hey, let the battle begin, baby. This is a... This is a fun league, you know what I mean? So, you know, th this one... We're not, like, super try-hard, so we don't need any, like, super toxic criticism or anything like that, man. We're just having fun, you know. Some Sometimes we'll, we'll bring some memes. Sometimes we'll bring some heat. Sometimes we'll do whatever, you know what I mean? So, um, in the end, it's all for fun. Uh, we're friends here. We're homies. This is my first time actually getting to battle with Nexus. Uh, we were supposed to battle in the NPA, but... Um, there were just a lot of complications there, like, with both sides, uh, just because of life. Life happens sometimes, life hits you hard sometimes, but if you guys are excited, if you guys are pumped, if you're ready, if you are about that action for the WBE, hit that thumbs up button, show some love, because we are about to roll out, we're about to roll out, baby. And, uh, we are, we're waiting on the boy right now. The boy Nexus is choosing his minds. But, guys, let me know definitely if, uh, there is any certain, like, set that you want me to run this season. Because I did do a draft, like a draft recap video or whatever. So, uh, you guys know all my Pokemon on my team. And, uh, if there's anything cool that you'd like to see, or maybe it's like funny not funny in like a trolling way but like funny in like a fun way i'm definitely down to do it okay and he brought some cool shit okay so i did think he would bring jolt or not jolt or, well i did think he'd bring jolt but i definitely thought he would bring um rachi chomp and blastoise and then the other th and then i thought um he would bring florges and jolteon but i guess this kind of works out um tangela could actually be kind of a problem though like if i'm just being honest and uh snorlax okay so i did prepare for snorlax so that's good um i'm hoping that you know like salazzle will be enough really to take care of tangela but um what do we lead with here we have a few options um part of me kind of wants to lead Scizor and just U-turn. Part of me wants to lead with Crook um, and just get up rocks. I think I'm honestly going to do that. Um, that was definitely going to be my plan if he didn't have removal, but he does anyways uh, with Rapid Spin on Blastoise. But you know what? Honestly, man, um, honestly, I think that if I can make him go out of his way to Rapid Spin them away... Oh, look at Oprah. Man, that that's... She's inspiration, man. That's that's the girl right there. But you know, he she looking good, man. She she looks good for real. But anyways, guys, if you're new here, I'd appreciate if you hit that subscribe button. Join the movement. You know what I mean? Join the movement. We're out here. He's actually gonna lead with Blastoise. That was really good um, on his behalf there. So he's he has um 
classic Kyle A fashion, I'm going to make a bad play on turn one. So <laughs> that's uh, that's okay. I think from here I just go into Slow King. I think I should have just did that from the jump. I should have started with Slow King, but um, that's okay. I could actually go into Tangrowth now that I think about it. I think I might as well go for Tangrowth. Because the good thing about Tangrowth and Slow King is they have that regeneration um, or regenerator. Same same thing, you know what I mean? So uh, I can switch in, take a hit, and then I can like switch back out and I get a third of my HP back. So unless he like hard predicts me turn one and goes for like HP fire or something like that, then you know we're gonna be good. Um, his Z crystal, I should have put Z crystals on the layout. Oh damn, I didn't even think of that. My Z crystal on my team is the fire Z crystal. I did uh, I did not bring it this week, um, just because I didn't really see too much of a point. He actually has uh, the dragon Z crystal, so um, that's something I do want to look out for on on Chomp um, or on Blastoise because you don't have to run the Mega, but he is obviously doing it right now. So in this league, you have the choice of running Mega or you can run Z crystal. You can't run like Choice Scarf. Like, I can't run Choice Scarf. Oh, ho, ho, my guy! With the prediction! Turn one! Bruh. What the fuck? And I am frozen. I am frozen solid. Turn one! Alright, guys. So, I want to let you guys know. Those of you that have already been uh, subscribed. Those of you that have already been on the journey with me you know in the p4g i literally am the god of getting hacked okay and i was hoping i could start this league out and and just be able to come in and just tear it up but it it it, it was too much it was too much for me um obviously so what do we do now i mean odds are he predicts this predicts me to switch goes for dark pulse Oh, man, that's so shitty. All right, first turn thaw. Because, like, I would switch and reserve my health, but I, I don't have anything that's going to want to switch into this. You know what I mean? I, I really messed up with leading Crook. I didn't expect him to lead Blastoise. That was good for him. I thought he was going to lead Rachi in, like, U-turn. But he's actually going to switch out, so that's fine. And he goes into Snorlax. Ooh. He goes into Snorlax. Thaw it out. First turn. Let's go. All right, that's fine. I'm okay with that. So, I think now we have a choice. He could maybe predict me to go low punny. Um, does Snorlax get a dragon move? I better check that, actually, because you never know, man. Normal types have these, like, insanely crazy, like, move pools, so... And, and you never know, man. He, he, you know, like I said, we was have, we're, we're having fun in this league, so he might be like Z Outrage or some shit. He does have Outrage, actually. Um, that would be pretty dope. But uh, I have Sylveon on my team, nor like in my lineup, so I don't know if he would be like ready for that. But part of me wants to just stay in and go for knockoff, because I do have the knockoff. Um, let's see here. I don't really know, like, there's so many Snorlaxes, you know what I mean? It's like, I don't know what which one he would be. Um, but I think I'm good, honestly, to just hit knockoff, and then I can switch next turn. So we do outspeed, which is good. We're going to take a um, AV. He has the fire punch, okay. That's going to do a lot. But now we can switch. Um, so we know he has fire punch Snorlax. And Ice Beam Blastoise. Alright, I think now it's time to switch. Um, we can go into... Uh, we could go into Slow King. And Scald. We could go into... Not Scizor, because he has Fire Punch. I think I'm going to go into Slow King. Because I, def I definitely want to switch out, so my Watermelon... My shiny Tangrowth, my boy, can get his HP back. So I'm going to go into Royalty, and uh, he goes for Body Slam. Okay, 
I'm probably gonna get paralyzed, guys. Like, if if I'm just being honest, I'm probably gonna get paralyzed. Okay, I didn't, which is dope. So that's good. Um, odds are he could be expecting me to just scald, and he could go for um, uh, back into Blastoise, which is why I think I'm going to reveal that I have the Grass Knot. No, I'm not. Grass Knot only does 12. I thought I would do more than that. That's crazy. Um, Snorlax. He's AV, so he's like none of these. <laughs> he's none of these. Um, but he does have Fire Punch, and we saw he has Body Slam. And Body Slam, 22 25. Okay, yeah, that's accurate. Um, I think... I might as well go for Scald. If he switches on me, then so be it. And that way, like, while it's, I can do my predictable plays while it's still early, and then I can mix it up towards the end, you know what I mean? Because I, I definitely didn't want to come out extra bold, like, fucking bold in italics and underlined, but I, you know, you gotta have a little spice, you know what I mean? You gotta have a little kick, you gotta have a little kick. I got some jalapeno chips right here. And those are good. And I got uh, some water. So he switches, probably in a Blastoise. Okay, so Grass Knot would have been the play, actually. But now I know that if I'm in this situation again, he's likely to do that. So I'm I'm good. Burn his ass. Burn his ass. Hey! All right, there we go. That's what I needed. Even though, like, it would have been better to Toxic him. But I don't even think I brought Toxic this week, honestly. No, I didn't. Um... So, what does a Dark Pulse do to us? Probably... <laughs> probably kills us, honestly. Uh, no, it doesn't kill us. Ooh, it... Dark Pulse doesn't kill us, for real? Even if he's modest, max special attack. Oh, yeah, because we're AV. Oh. Oh. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Royalty. That's royalty right there. All right, so he does go for the Dark Pulse. Oh, okay, good. We didn't get flinched. I thought we were going to get fucking flinched, man. I literally just got flinched against Galactic Elliot when he used, um, when he used, uh, that move on me, Dark Pulse, with Mega Blastoise. So I was like, it's only, uh, it's only right that it happens to me again, right? Um... All right, I have a few choices here. I can switch. What does he go for? Does he go for Dark Pulse again? Does he go for Ice Beam? I think he goes for Ice Beam, predicting... Um, the, uh, the Watermelon guy. Tank Growth. I think he predicts Tank Growth. Um, the good news is I can switch into... I can hope that he goes... Let's see, if he goes for Ice Beam, it does 20, hmm. Huh, how do I want to do this, man? Because I don't want to go into Croc, because if he goes for Scald or Ice Beam, it's going to kill me. Um, but if I go into Scizor, what about Aura Sphere? How much does Aura Sphere do? Because I don't know what all he has. I don't know what all he has, man. Uh, Aura Sphere... Okay, so there's a lot. I think, honestly, that's going to be my best bet, though, because he doesn't have Reuniclus. So, he has Reuniclus on his team, which is part of the reason why I wanted to bring um, Scizor. He didn't bring that, so um, I think that that's going to... Okay, he does go for the Dark Pulse. That's ouch. That's going to do, like, 60%. Ah! Oh, oh, no! <laughs> okay, um, so we know... Or actually, we don't know if we outspeed this thing. Um, so I really don't have a choice but to go for Bullet Punch. And if I don't kill him... Oh, no! If I don't kill him, I'm kind of fucked. But, uh... Hmm. Because this... It does 23... Let's see, he outsped my... Uh, this is the see this is this is where it gets tricky now 
Because I can go for Bullet Punch, but if he has any kind of defensive investment, I don't kill him. Hey, but you know what? We live life on the edge, baby. Let's go. We, li we live, we live, we live for this shit. I live for this. I live for moments like this. Damn it. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, so that's on me. Um, is it a double KO, though? It is. Okay. Not the worst. Um, Mega Blast kills Scizor with Dark Pulse and um, Slow King kills Mega Blastoise with Burn. Alright. So, definitely not how I wanted that to go down. Like, fucking at all. But um, it could have been worse. Could have definitely been worse, but you know what? <sighs> that's that's just how it goes. Um, it's good that we got Blastoise out of the way. I think now we can bring in Lopunny. Could bring in Lopunny. Or I could bring in Crook. And yeah, I'm gonna bring in Crook now and set up rocks. That's, because that's what I need. Okay, he brings in Tangela. What can Tangela do to me, dude? Tangela also has Regenerator. It can do 62 with... Um... Giga Drain. But I know I'm Scarf, so I'm gonna get up Rocks. Or I'm not Scarf, actually. What am I talking? What am? What are you talking about, Kyle? You're not Scarf. You're um. Uh, lefties. I'm lefties. Okay, so he may think that I have. Oh, I got the Z crystal, the fire Z crystal. So he may think I got like Z fire fang or some shit. Um, so he might actually switch out here. But if I can get rocks up before Blazekin comes in, it will be huge. It would be huge. Because I, I could see him staying in and just attacking me, or I could see him switching out. Um, let's say I did have Fire Fang. Uh, Eighteen to twenty-two. If it's a Z move, thirty-five eh, percent. Okay. Oh man, guys, I'm. I love League Battles. Okay, I'm not the best. I'm definitely not the best by far. You guys can already tell. You know what I mean? Um, I'm not even that good, really, but I have fun. Like, as cliche as it sounds, I got my Don Fans tank top on, and I do wash this bitch. I just wear it whenever I do League stuff, okay? So I wash it all the time. Like, it's always in the washer. But, um, all right, so we are going to get up rocks. But I just, I have fun doing this, man. I, I love it. So he does go for the Giga Drain. Okay. That does about what I expected. Okay. So, we got rocks up, which is good. We got rocks up, which is real good. Um, now, I honestly think I can go into... Tangrowth. Or I can go into Salazzle. And just be Scarfed and just... Go Hammer. But I think I should probably go into Tangrowth. And then I can knock off and get rid of the Eviolite. Because the thing that's... Okay, so Tangela and Tangrowth, right? Like, they're both super bulky. But Tangela has an advantage because it can run Eviolite and it can get plus one defense and plus one special defense. But then um, Tangrowth has an advantage because he can run any item. You know what I mean? All right, so we're toxic, which kind of sucks. But honestly, I see that we can we can go for knockoff right here. Um, I do have the HP fire, but I'm just gonna go for knockoff. If he goes into Snorlax, then good shit for him. But um, and if he's like Resto Chesto or something Snorlax, because I, I forget if we saw its item. Honestly, um, I know it has Fire Punch, but. I forget if we saw his item. 
because I didn't type it down. Because I didn't, because your boy didn't type it down, that's all. But, um, this is a good battle. I like this. I like this so far. Both making some switches, making some plays, doing some thinking. I, I like thinking, man. I, I like, that's the thing I like about Wi-Fi battles is that they, and they get you thinking sometimes. Because it's like, especially in League, when it's like, oh man, like, is he going to have this absurd ass move that like I would never expect or is he gonna be generic or is he gonna be this or that or this or that when it's like on Smogon like yeah sometimes you get a few changes but like most of the part it's like cookie cutter stuff you know what I mean it's like oh shit this beats me this doesn't beat me I beat this you know what I mean but it's like in this it's like Tangela is a threat you know what I mean it's like oh my gosh like dude I'm, I had to prep for a Tangela you know like it's dope man I like it I like that shit but what's gonna happen? All right, does he go into Snorlax? No, he goes into Rachi. Whew. Let's go, baby. All right, so he's gonna take rocks and then knock off. Oh, he's Culperberry. Okay, that's fine. So he's Culverberry. What would Rachi be able to do to this? Is what I want to know. Um, I kind of want to go into Croc and just lower his attack, like just straight up Intimidate switch. Um, he may have went in here to U-turn. Jirachi gets rocks, I know. Um... Honestly, I'm gonna see what he wants to do. I have the earthquake, so I think I'm just gonna go for that. Oh, he's gonna wish. Dope. All right, so he's wishing. He's he's straight up. I wish you would. And okay, now call me crazy, but I think. This is a good time to go low punny. We're gonna go into our hoe bunny right here, okay? Now, you may be thinking, Kyle, why the fuck would you bring in low punny on a psychic type? But, like, the thing is, if he's wishing, odds are he's going to protect here, or he's going to switch or something. So, um, I can set up, basically. I have Encore on this low punny, so I can Encore him into protect or something. Um, no, he has fire punch, okay. All right, so at least he's real about it. At least he's real about it. He, he's staying in. That boy, that boy's staying in. Um, but I can mega here. And um, let's see. Now I have... Uh, he has no item. I think he's, like, defensive. Some's telling me he's defensive. But uh, let's see here. I'll go into my whole bunny. High jump kick already does 55. But if I mega... I think I can go for power up punch right here. I'm gonna go for power up punch. I don't wanna go for high jump kick because if he uses protect, then I'm kind of fucked. But um, if I go for the power up punch, I can get plus one and I can still do that. So I know I'm gonna outspeed him. It's only gonna do like 17% roughly, maybe 20. Yeah, so not a lot at all. Uh, does he have? He has heart stamp. Ooh, the boy has the heart stamp. We live in. All right, so we live in that. Um, we outspeed him. We're plus one now. We can kill him with high jump kick, but I think if he has protect, we're gonna die. Um, honestly, that's what I think. I knew it, man! I knew it, 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 I knew it. But you know what, honestly, honestly, man, I ain't even that mad because I would have missed anyway, so, um, low punny dies to fuckery. <laughs> dies to missing. Dies to missing. 
good shit nexus on that one so that was the obvious play right there for me i definitely kind of fucked that one up um but you know hey it is what it is right um let's see what okay what can i do from here though because now your boy's at a disadvantage by far definitely at a disadvantage uh And I'm playing too obviously. Way too obviously. So I think what I should do is I can go into Salazzle and basically threaten him out. And I have a choice because I can... I can pretty much... Like, he knows I would kill him, basically, right? Like, there's no way he can live this, right? Actually, he can live this. What the fuck? Um, but odds are he goes into like Garchomp maybe. Or Flamethrower does like nothing. Um, he could go into Blaziken, he could go into Snorlax. So part of me wants to predict him to switch and go for the Sludge Bomb. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm doing it. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I played too obviously with low punny and it costed me. Um, so you know what? I'm gonna predict him to switch. Oh man, see that's what I'm talking about, bro. Like I should have, like I knew it in my heart. I knew in my heart, man, that that he had protect. But part of me was like, I'm too real. Like I'm, I'm too. I'm far too. I'm far too real for this. I gotta. I gotta go for it. And, uh, I got cucked, so. Now he's thinking, now he's thinking, okay, how real is Kyle? Is he, is he real AF? Is he real AF? Or is he like, eh, eh, like, kind of, like, he like, mm, like, he may think I'm a replica, but I'm trying to show I'm authentic right now. So, I'm, I'm gonna predict that switch. Oh, that's why I need it right there. Goes into Snorlax. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that sexy little sludge bomb. We do get the poison, which is dope. Okay, now here I have a choice because I can just sludge bomb him again. Well, I'm scarfed, so it's either I do that or I switch. I think I'm going to go for Sludge Bomb again because I can't let him rest on me. Especially after... Okay. So I think we're going to kill him here with this. Uh, okay, good. So... Salazzle kills Snorlax with Sludge Bomb. Alright, dope. That's what I needed right there. Because now I know that he can't, like, recover on me. Because I lost Mega Low Punny, so I was going to be fucked against that thing. So that's good. Good shit, Salazzle. Good shit, Salazzle. That's why I got you on the team. I, I needed you. I needed you to be my side chick, and you came through. Alright, Blaziken takes rocks. This can get EQ. I feel like it gets EQ. You strike me as something that would get Earthquake. Like, if I had to guess. It has to. It has to get Earthquake, right? Because I always see him run, like, low kick and shit. Yeah, it definitely gets EQ. Um, the good thing is, I would still outspeed it either way. But I can't afford to let my Salazzle go down, so I think I have to switch. Um, I could switch into Croc. Or I could switch in... I'd be stupid to switch into Tangrowth. I think he expects me to go into Royalty. So part of me just wants to sludge bomb again. I'm doing it. He 
He does have the EQ. Okay, that's fine. So we're gonna die to that. There, there's no way we live that. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that HP fall. <laughs> Holy cow. Um, Blaziken kills Salazzle with EQ. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. Um, now is where shit gets interesting. Now it's where shit gets interesting because we lose this matchup. Like, straight up, we lose this matchup on paper. Like, there, there's no way. Um, I feel like he's going to be fast enough with Blaziken to kill the rest of our shit. So, um... I feel like we have to go Tangrowth. Or not Tangrowth. I feel like we have to go Slow King here. That was a good play of him to do that to... Because I should have... I could have switched into Tangrowth and ate that. Um, I don't know if he's choiced. But I'm gonna go Slow King. I'm gonna go Slow King because why not? Because I'm the motherfucking realist. Some mo some the motherfucking roof. And um, ice beam will not kill you, but scald definitely can. The only problem is he's gonna outspeed me. And what does he hit me with? If slow king dies right here, I lose straight up. Okay, so he does switch. He's probably gonna go into uh, Tangela. Yeah, he does. Okay, so that's fine. Um, if I could burn him, that would help tremendously. But. I'm not sure if I can do that. Um, we do. Oh, my God. Okay, now I feel bad because even though, you know, I got frozen turn one and, uh, you know, whatnot, he got burned. I'm two for two with Scald Burns. I think I think royalty is just the fucking god. I think that's straight up. I think that's what it is, honestly. I think royalty is just a god, and uh, he should never be doubted. I think nobody should ever doubt Slow King, ever. I bet Slow King gets a lot. A lot of booty. I bet. I bet that boy's in there on the side. You know, what I mean? look at him. He's got the, the thing on on his shoulders. I don't know what that is. Like the. It reminds me of like the like the ring that like a lifeguard would have that like throw in the water or whatever. But like his is like wavy, you know, because he's wavy. Because that boy wavy. But burning that actually helped us out a lot. Although it does get regenerated, which is annoying. He's probably gonna bring. Ooh. You know what I didn't even think of? We probably outspeed Tangela, don't we? No, hell no, we don't. What are you? What am I? Kyle, are you high? No, I'm not high. I've actually never been high before. But, um. You know. Oh, well. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, so he's. Oh, that's me switching. I was like, he switches? No, that's me switching. Okay. Um, hopefully he'll go for Toxic right here. Dope. Alright, cool. Um, so we do have the HP Fire, which is cool. I think Blaziken dies to rocks if he comes in. Um, so... That's good. HP Fire hits, uh, Jirachi too. So, if he goes Rachi, that can kind of help us. Um... We're, we're playing man down here. We're playing man down, but I'm trying. I'm not trying to give up. Never give up. Never surrender. DJ Khaled. All right, so he does switch. Who's he going to do? He goes into Rachi. That helps us. Okay, so he's going to take some rocks. I didn't predict that, but HP fire. It does fucking zero. We're not HP fire. Am I hit? Oh, am I hitting Power of Ice? F fuck. I'm hitting Power Ice. RIP. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I knew that. I knew that. Why do I think I was HP Fire? Because I'm a fucking idiot? Okay. All right. That's bad. That was bad for us. That right there was, was bad for us. Um... Okay, so we know his Jirachi has 
What does he have? He has Heart Stamp, Wish, Protect, and Fire Punch, right? Or no, Snorlax have Fire Punch. I don't think we know Rachi's fourth move. So I think we got to switch here and go into... I think I got to go... I think I got to go to Croc. I think I got to go Crocodile and hope that he, like, wishes or some shit. Because he might wish and, like, try to pass it to Blaziken or something. But at least we get, get him to minus one. That's good. He goes for Fire Punch. Uh, Crook. EQ can kill him. We don't outspeed, though. But he might think we do. Which is kind of wanna why, kind of wanna why, kind of why I wanna go for pursuit and hit him. But like, if he stays in, pursuit don't do shit. But I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm going for it, baby. Although he has seen that I'm lefties. But yeah. So he does have Fire Punch. Okay, so I'm not mistaken. Okay, so he has Fire Punch, a Heart Stamper, his only two attacking moves. So Crook walls him because Heart Stamp can't even hit me and Fire Punch does 10. So, And he doesn't have rocks, so that's good. So I can like freely switch him in and just get the Intimidate on Rachi, which is good. If he switches out here, Pursuit could be huge for us. So we're fighting an uphill battle, but we got a chance, man. We we it's not it's not unwinnable, it's just unlikely. But uh, you know, your, your boy's going for it. Okay, so he does go for Oh yes. Does this kill? No. It just does a lot. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. He goes in a blaze can. Do you die to rocks? No, you don't die to rocks. So we're lefties. Who do I need the least? Probably Watermelon. Is he going to predict the double? Or, I mean, is he going to predict me in double? Oh, man. Because that would be crazy. Oh, damn. Look at my hair. Look at my hair. And I came with the glasses today. Your boy's rocket. My glasses are dirty as hell, too. Like, you could see the stuff on them. But, oh well. Oh well! Am I right? Okay. This is a good ass battle. This is a good battle. How are we gonna handle this? Alright, I switch. Your boy switches. I go into Watermelon. If he, like, Flare Blitzes me right here, that would be a god tier play. <laughs> I'll be a god tier. Hey, I never doubted it, man. That boy Nexus. And he kills me, too. Not bad at all. Did you die? Okay, he dies. Okay. So, uh, Blaziken kills Tang with Flare Blitz. Blaziken dies to recoil. Okay, so at least we, like, it sucks that I fucking lost Mega Low Punny, like, so easily, but, like, it kind of bounces out for me because he, like, straight, um, sacked off his, uh, homeboy, his Blaziken. Okay, um, now here's the question. Who does he go into? Because if he goes Tangela right here, I'm kind of fucked. Like, if he goes Tangela, I'm fucked. I never thought I would say that in my life. I never in my entire life did I think I would say, man, if, if my opponent goes into Tangela, I'm fucked. <laughs> oh my god. Holy cow. I'm a legend. Let's see. Slow King. I'm going Slow King. I'm going Royalty. Going royalty, baby. 
All right, he does go Tangela. Okay, so he's burned too, but we know he has the Giga Drain. So he's gonna take rocks. I'm gonna Ice Beam him. Oh, he's got Leech Seed. Okay, that's fine. I can switch out, <laughs> which kind of is bogus, but you know, hey, <laughs> but hey, hey. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Hold on. So he gets health back, but he gets burned. Crook dies, right? Crook dies to Giga Drain. Is that how I win, though? He never sent out Garchomp. He never sent out Garchomp. And Jirachi... Yeah, I think I just have to go for Ice Beam because I, even if I sack off, like, sacking off Crook does nothing for me. Okay, so he switches into Rachi. Oh, I think he lives this. I should have went for Scald. Uh, there's no way I would have predicted that switch. That was God tier. Oh my god, and now I freeze him. Dude, I'm so sorry, man. Like, that, that sucks. That sucks. Dick. Right there, did that happen to you? Um, at least I know that he's probably gonna sack it off now, but like, that sucks, dude. At least I got frozen too, you know what I mean? Like, he got frozen at a critical time, which blows. Like, I feel so bad for him, but like, I got froze turn one. So like, obviously his was worse at least it was both of us, but that sucks, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. Like, that's bogus. That's some bogus shit right there. He's frozen solid, and I think he lives a Scald, actually. Like, I think he, I think this doesn't even kill him. Oh, no, it does. Okay. Um, kills. Jirachi with Scald. He goes into Tangela. Now, here's where I have to switch and get this Leech Seed off of me. No, I think I have to... I have to Ice Beam. Ah, this is crazy. So Giga Drain. Okay. He's burned too. So he's at half. I have a chance to kill him, but I think he's specially defensive, so I won't kill him. Unless... Oh, he's got Leech Seed too. Oh, rip. That's actually crazy. That's This, this battle is actually crazy. Like, holy cow. Um, right here I have to switch, which sucks. But I have to. Maybe he'll switch too and we'll luck out, but I don't know. Intimidate does nothing. So he giga drains us. Okay, so we sack Crook, which sucks because I think we lose. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we lose, but that was a good ass battle, dude. Like, I don't even care. Like, that was crazy. And I think he has the Z move 
on Garchomp because he never did bring it out and Garchomp can uh, easily kill our Slow King. So, holy cow, GG to Nexus. I think, I think we're going to lose 1-0. I think we're going to lose 1-0. Um, Tangela kills Crook with Giga Drain. Uh, Crook is gone. Goddamn Giga Drain, dude. Oh my god, it does so much. But, that was a good battle, man. I, I don't have, uh, you know, I, I don't have recovery because I'm Assault Vest. Slow King kills Tangle Level Ice Beam, and Garchomp kills Slow King. He's probably got the Z move. He goes for EQ. That's still gonna kill us. I mean, we're at 50. Like, oh! dude, if I'd have lived on one, I could have killed him with Ice Beam. Holy shit! All right, so we're gonna lose that one, one zero. -oh, but oh my lord, that that was honestly probably one of the best league battles I've ever had. Like, if I'm being honest, like, and I mean, I've won battles. I've won battles by landslides. I've lost by landslides. But like, I, I've had a I've had a few close ones. This is probably one of my favorite close ones that I've ever had. And it was a long video, so it was like I don't know, like forty five minute battle or something. Maybe I don't know forty. But um, check out Nexus, man. Super dope. Happy I got to battle him. Somebody I've always watched their content, and uh, you know that that's what's up, man. I'm I'm honored that I got to battle him. Happy to be in this league, guys. And uh, we're gonna start out 0 1, but hey, look at me. We never back down, baby. We don't. We just don't do it. That's all I got though for you, Don fans. Roll out.